Hi everyone and welcome to this Magnus Billing video tutorial. In this tutorial, we will discuss adding multiple VoIP accounts for a single user in Magnus Billing. Free calls can be made between these accounts. This can be handy for companies and offices. It's also handy when you want to have multiple users calling but credit debited from only one main account. When we make a new user in Magnus Billing, it automatically creates a VoIP account for the user. So let's go ahead and make a new user. In this case, we'll call this user Magnus Test. We'll fill in the username and any additional fields that we want, and then we'll click Save. We can now see that the new user has been created. Here we can see all the details about the new user, such as the username, password, name, email, credit, the plan, and the group. We can change any of these details to our liking if we need. We can also fill in the personal data. Now that this user is created properly, we can see that, we'll go to the view OIP Accounts tab. In the VoIP account, we'll filter for Magnus Test, which is our test user, and we can see that it automatically generated a SIP account. This account is automatically linked to the user we just created. However, one user can have multiple VoIP or multiple SIP accounts. In this case, we will simply create a new VoIP account using the New button. We will select the user that we already created, and then we'll add in a new username and a new password. We will then click Save. We can now see that Magnus Test has two VoIP accounts belonging to the same user. We can eliminate or change the original account if we'd like. We can also add as many accounts as we want for this user. You can see here that we can edit the details. Since these accounts can be used to communicate with each other at no cost, it is very helpful to add multiple accounts for an office setup or a company setup. All of these accounts will be able to call out and they will be charged based on the primary user's rates. The credit for all of these users will be debited from the main owner account. This is very handy if you want to have multiple users call out and only manage one set of credit. That will conclude this video tutorial. Remember to subscribe to our channel. This video has been sponsored by Synops Global, www.synopsglobal.com.